The Loper Volleyball Squad defeated Missouri Western in four sets to capture the MIAA Tournament Championship Saturday, November 18th at the Health and Sports Center. I think to achieve back-to-back -back conference championships and tournament championships in this day and age of MIAA Volleyball, uh, I think we need to take the time to really appreciate how difficult it is. It means a lot to us, it really does. It shows how hard we've worked this whole season and coming from last season, it gave us a lot of momentum. We worked really hard during the off season to prove ourselves. To maintain the focus in between the conference tournament and the NCAA tournament is a very inexact science. Just walk that fine line between having fun and doing things that are enjoyable and, and uh, also rolling up your sleeves and getting to work. And so they, they know how difficult it is to go up and play in this regional. So I, I think they'll do a good job with that. I think we're very prepared. I think definitely we had a great off season. Even this whole season, we've always had really good practices. Coaches pushed us. We've pushed each other to make ourselves better. And I think that's really going to show. They really don't care who gets the credit. They're, they're very low ego. They want team success and they want everybody to feel like they're a part of it. And I, I think that's been a big reason we've had a good year. Despite losing Annie Wolf, the 2016 Division II Player of the Year, Ziggelbein feels confident in her team as they approach NCAA tournament play. A lot of people, including myself, has really stepped into that role, both on and off the court, to make our team very cohesive and we have a very dynamic balance between all the players on our team. This team this year to make a run at this tournament I think is pre as prepared as you can be. Uh, the, the thing about this regional is if you get rolling and you pop out of it at the other end, you probably got an inside track at a national championship. UNK was tabbed the third seed of the central region. They meet up again with number six, Missouri Western, on Thursday, November 30th in Marshall, Minnesota.